Welcome to Tech Lake video tutorials. This session I am going to explain about on nullif function. Like most of the requirement, like if you want to uh, validate some data, if you want to validate some data, based on that validation, if you want to take uh, some other data, if you want to take some uh, some null values, if you want to pass that. So that time we will go for case expression or if condition normally. So same thing uh, you can implement using this function. So functions is first compared to normal uh, uh, case or uh, if then conditions. Okay. So null if uh, function uh, will have a two parameters. That is expression one. You can expression two. You can pass this. If first parameter is if you see here first parameter and two param second parameter is equal, it will return null like uh, comparison like comparison. First parameter and second parameter is same. It will return null. If first parameter and second parameter is not null, not sorry, not equal, not equal, it will return first parameter value. It will return first parameter value. So if you look at this example, I have employee table. I have a salary and commission. You can see here. If both are same, if both are equal, it will return null. Both are equal. If you can see here nullif function, two parameters I am passing here, two is mandatory, two parameters is mandatory and if both are equal, it will return null, if both are not equal, it will return first parameter value, it will return first parameter value, first parameter is salary, so it is returning first parameter value. Like this, we can use comparing two columns data or two expressions using nullif using null if. So null if that is if condition plus null that's the reason the name is called null if. So it's same as like if condition like if some expression equal to some uh, expression 2 then null else expression 1. It is like same as if condition or you can say case also case also case expression 1 then null else so like this we can use if condition or case expression same logic we can implement using this function that is called null f null plus if condition that is null if function. So here if both parameters are equal it will return null. It will return null. If both parameters are not equal it will return first parameter. It will return first parameter like this you can see. It's like a if condition or you can say case expression like this. So same thing, same logic you can implement in null if function, null if function. So if you have a requirement like uh, if, if you have a sales data, previous month sales and the current one sales, if both are same, I don't want to display some, uh, some data. If both are different, having some difference, so I want to display uh, current month uh, sales. Like this, if you want to go for like a uh, uh, comparing uh, those values that time you can go for null if function null if function it's like a if condition you can uh, use the same condition using null if function so thank you for watching my videos please subscribe my channel to get more videos and update my channel thank you very much